Hello there everyone and welcome back to Fallout 4. We're going after issue number three of uh, one of the magazines today, which unfortunately appears to be in this graveyard here. Now I vaguely recall going past this graveyard in the past and noticing that it was absolutely chock-a-block full of um, ghouls. So that's not a good thing. I'm thinking I might be able to sneak in if I'm careful. But I'm going to have to be super duper careful, like crazy careful here. To not aggro these guys, because yeah. Oh, wow. Well. Really? I might actually be able to do this if I'm in the right part of the graveyard. does not look like I am. I was hoping that was a flight of stairs, but apparently it's not. Okay. Well, if we operate under the assumption that this marker we're sitting on is in one of these buildings, which makes a lot of sense, really, we might just be able to pull it off very, very carefully, very, very sneakily, because... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, they spotted me. They spotted something. Come on, let's go. Let's go, go, go. Come on, out of there. Out of there. Oof. God darn zombies. Oh, I should have set a landmine in there. That would have been amazing. They know I'm out there, but they don't know where. I'm just making sure they're not walking up in this direction here, because if they are, we have to run like crazy. Is there a defensible location nearby? Not close enough to matter at the moment. I could use a stealth boy. Okay. All right. So we are theoretically hidden now. I really wish that the detected and hidden would not apply to my followers. All right, that one's sealed. That one's also sealed, okay. What's left? We've got a little church, a little shack, This is, uh, would have been quite a lovely graveyard before it was, you know, overrun by zombies and kind of ruined by the apocalypse. Okay, the other unfortunately possible place it could be... Uh oh Time to go. Go, go, go. There are way too many ghouls for us to fight right now. Not with our current uh, gear load. Well, if we end operate under the assumption that it's close but not precise, the magazine might be in this church, little church building over here. It would make sense for it to be in the burned out church rather than in the... Um, a graveyard itself. All right, let's sneak in. There's a story here. We'll find it. All right. Let's see. If I was a magazine in a ruined old church, where would I be? not present from the looks of it. Unless it's one I got already. I'm trying to remember. Was I here before in this series? <sighs> you know, I might have been. There's there's some... Because all it's telling me is that it's in this location somewhere. 
I'll just turn them all off except for one and see. Okay. So, is it Wasteland Survival? Nope. Not that one. Tesla Science doesn't make sense. Neither does Tumblr's today. Rogue Co. doesn't make sense either. Total Hack. You know, it's probably the surgical journal, and I remember, I might remember coming here. Yep, it's a surgical journal. I think I have that one back home, dang it. Which means I just need to go clear the uh, mission so that it's not sitting here confusing me anymore. Okay then. Well, let's change plans then. Let's go see if we can find that caravan and see what happened there. Over by Covenant, because, well, we can. Let's just hope we're not getting followed by ghouls right now, because that would suck. Uh-oh. Alright, dog, meet up and add up. Get up, big guy. Awesome. Well, that did not work out quite the way I would have liked. <laughs> Here I am trying to avoid ghouls, and oh, there's a ghoul. Look at that. Just about stomped on the dang thing. Alright, there's Covenant. And the Minutemen apparently are in the neighborhood, which is good. Now, Covenant obviously has some issues, primarily with people who have nothing to do, I would say. And actually, if I'd been thinking, I would have actually started dispatching people from uh, other settlements. Right now, I just want to quickly save my game and then continue south. I'm new around. That was uh, not ideal. Yes, there probably is, but um, mostly what's going to happen is I'm going to be dispatching you to a new location in a minute. You know what? All right, fine. We'll just uh, go for now. Covenant's not an important... It's an important arriving settlement, and I do need to make it a nicer place for people, but... Um, Right now I've got places to go, to go and things that I want to do, and... Well, I would like to, uh... Uh-oh. What have I done? Something saw me. What did I attract the attention of? Oh! There is an interesting thing up on that... All right, we're gonna take the low-level bridge. Here's the dang blood bug. Just barely see it, it must be hanging over top of the, uh... What the heck saw me? Gotta be those dang bugs. Silly things are a pain in my... everything, really. Alright, so... From here, there's an issue 5 across the bay over there, which means crossing a bridge and crossing back, and I remember... Can't remember what I even fought in that one. 
There we go. Blood bug down. Nice shot. Oh, I've only got 30 shots left too, so I better be careful. You know, I don't even know what tree it was on. All right. So, you're not an idiot. Forget it. Forget that blood bug. Let's go see what we got across the bridge here. Okay. So we got mines. The bridge has been mined. Oh, heavily mined. Well, this is a nice... This will be nice. Oh, that's a hole in the... Okay, I have the gas canisters. Because that's oil in the uh, bank. We're washing on an, walking on an oil slick. That is incredibly dangerous with these landmines here. I think a couple of... Uh, one bad shot would cause this whole bridge to go up like a... Oh! Oh my. Okay, well something's going on over there. Alright, what's going on? Lasers. Cybermech swarm bot. What was that? Oh my. Go, go, go. Set some landmines. Oh my god! Okay, so... Robots. Robots bad. Make a note. Um... Ooh, I have an idea. I have an idea. We can do this. Um, although we don't have our heavy, heavy weapons on us right now, do we? I don't even think we have a rocket launcher anymore. Um, let me think here. Could grab our laser. I could set some... That's going to be a hard one. That is going to be a hard, hard fight. I think we need to redirect our efforts. So that is going to be an ugly fight. That's what I've learned today. This is Super Mutant Central here. Oh, what can we do with our perks that might help? Robotics Expert. Hack a robot. That's not really going to help me right now, is it? What's a good weapon against a robot? So this is a big one. This this is going to be more armor piercing on my rifles. Oh, except I can't get another rank in it yet. Okay, we've got Bloody Mess, which we can't get yet. 5% bonus damage when the enemy's below 30% health. That's not going to help immensely. Yep. Sixth Sense, Environmental Accuracy in Vats. Total Health and Action Points. Melee Attacks. Hmm. 
Explosives do 15% more damage, crippling limbs. Well, I think explosives are going to be a good friend. Oh, maybe I should get this. I was talking about being able to pick master locks. Oh, but that next rank is big. That crippling limbs is going to be an important characteristic going forward. If we had a good supply of clean water, things would be pretty good. Where is my magic box? I must have a magic box here, don't I? If I don't, that's a pretty severe, uh, serious oversight. I'm so happy you're on our side. Looks like I have not added a magic box to the covenant. All right, let's go up, up. Metal supply crate. All right, water's the big thing that's making them unhappy here, is it? The trade, the water trade, must not be working quite right because there should be enough water in our overall system to supply this place. Need fifteen total to make everybody here happy. One, there's two. Okay. Everybody's happy, nobody's angry, all that jazz. Pardon me. There's the mystical box of all important item storing. What do I have in here? Pulse grenade. That's really. That might work. That might work on these things. I mean, frag grenades are going to be the most likely candidate for good weapons. But if I can lob a pulse grenade along... If I can lob a pulse grenade all, the whole way um, into that mess, that might be enough to make the difference. Although I don't have enough ammo for this either, which is bad. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, no, I'm not ready for this. As much as I want to be... That is biting off way more than I can chew right now. Let's get our butts out of here. Let's hop on a motorcycle. Oh, right. What should be our next move? You know what? You know what I really want to do right now? Let's make sure I got the item to do it. I need to grab a new cola out of here. And go give Sheffield a Nuka Cola finally, because I've never actually done that. All right. And I have a feeling it might actually lead to something story wise. So we are going to. Oh! What did I just transfer? Very heavy things. All right, let's roll. Oh, just magical storage box of magic. And of course, Hangman's Alley takes uh, four fuel, not two. But maybe I should be going to, I no, actually I should be going to Starlight Drive-In first. Anyways, making myself some more ammunition. I'm getting generally ready to go and have a nice big, f nice battle. Okay. Yeah, so. Hmm. Well, yeah, so ammunition. So robots, I should have, should have realized robots are pretty nasty as well. All right, let's go fire this beastie up. Factory. Online. Lots of fertilizer, lots of steel. Alright, let's go in the meantime while this is working. 
let's fire up the uh, settlement manager and see what's got these people unhappy right now. Beds, of course it's beds. Good thing I lot lots of room for nice beds. And I left lots of room up here for, whoa, okay, I did not leave lots of room for growth. Okay. Okay, guess we'll do it this way. Let's get the stairway floor here. All right. All right, with this in place, let's get some walls in play going. We're making an honest to goodness um, tower, aren't we? <laughs> and I actually want to move more people in here too, so that's a thing. Let's get some floors, no, not roofs, floors. We need the shack upper floors. All right, good. Rest of the roof in place. Because beds are the thing that make people unhappy faster than just about anything. Nowhere to sleep makes people very unhappy. Fortunately, I can squeeze everybody into a pretty compact state here by going vertical. I might actually consider putting in a balcony or something in the future, but right now we're just going for a nice... solid structure. So we're looking for the one that we already have a copy of, which is that one. There we go. Very quickly add some beds to this. And we're going to be inviting some more people over, so let's... Uh, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then did I put a TV room in here? I did not, did I? Let's just put a TV and a couple chairs and a television in under the stairs here. That's just a little bit of happiness inducing. some power over here as well. Oh, it's got power. Excellent. I could also put lights in, but that should be okay for now. Got some unassigned settlers to take care of as well, so we need to get another batch of these uh, scavenging stations in play, because that's one of the big things we do here, is we scavenge for things. Two... Three, four, five, six. At some point, I'm going to have to actually defend this place properly. Seven, eight, nine. Good enough for now. All right. Let's make the, uh, now let's just make sure 
We have lots of corn still being grown here, which is good. Lots of things in storage here. It's doing that thing again, isn't it? All right, we'll start this. Manage settlers, first of all. List all settlers. Unassigned, go to scavenging station, check. Unassigned number two, assigned to, I hope it's showing us ones that are unassigned. Scavenging station, well, if it's doing it right, it shouldn't unassign people, so it should be okay. All right, let's just check. Check, check, check. All right. Let's go to Covenant. Here we go. Manage settlers, list all settlers. We'll ignore these. I wonder, can we actually... These twits we can't even assign to stuff, so... Move to Starlight. Assigned objects, no, that won't happen until he's here. Move, Starlight. This is probably the easier way to, whoops. Good. Move, Starlight. I might actually even be able to over assign uh, settlements this way. Whoops, I guess he's going to Sunshine Tiding. That's okay. All right, how are we doing on ammo manufacture here? 250 rounds, awesome. Power down. We need more water. Water pump. Seriously? You've got tons of water here already. What the, uh, I guess, it's interesting that the water trade system is not officially um, working as advertised. There we go. 108, so there we are. Water 28 instead of, oh wow, we ran out of oil? Good. Keep that up. Okay, hopefully that will start going up now. Now, I'm not sh I'm not sure that actually turned on. I think we need I think what I need to do is do some more power related things here. And just run a couple of power lines along the side of this building here. There we go. Alright, let's get a few lights out here. Because lights make people happy. Okay. That should be starting to help, although let's make use of our... So, Starlight Drive-In is happy. Water and beds are an issue at Sunshine again. Red Rocket is fine. Covenant has got a food problem, of course. Abernathy Farm has a food problem. I could swear they're supposed to be trading, but there might be something going wrong there. Mines. 
What's it going to take to make a pulse mine? One more level of science, huh? And fertilizer. And oil. If I'm going to get through that. What about a cryo grenade? Or sorry, a pulse grenade. Same deal. Okay. Now then, yeah, so if I grabbed fertilizer and oil, can make cryo mines, but I think the frag mines are going to be far more useful for me. All right. We need fertilizer to do that. Yes. Which I think I've probably used almost all of it up. We need the brown all right let's do it this way yes 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 I can't make need to get back to Diamond City drop the rich fertilizer. still need oil. This means utility, cutting fluid, purified water being the limiting factor on that. Now the other way to make it was to cook it. Utility, oil. I'm ready to help whatever you can Just say the word. Good stuff. Okay. Now we go craft, mines, three more frag mines, deposit all my stuff, beer bottles I want though. I'm, not, I'm carrying a few extra things but not a huge number. But I think we're going to go to uh, Diamond City next. Just see what's got me weighed down right now. Because I don't usually have that much mass on me. Oh, it's the massive amount of ammo I've just crafted. Let's take it down to... we'll put away 170 of them. It's a little better. And grab four fuel. Or five fuel. That's fine. Dr Another day of hard. Fill a couple bottles and hit the road. So there's a lot of preparate preparation, um, which is not entirely what I'd plan to do with this episode. But such is life. Um, so, Hangman's Alley. Here we come, and then off to Diamond City. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye for now.